Hello my students of class 6 standard so today we are going to start grammar chapter number 6 nouns gender what is this nouns gender okay students now whatever I have marked you have to just go through this when I talk about gender or when I'm speaking about gender what do I mean gender means when I talk about masculinity or femininity masculine means men gender okay male gender and femininity means uh, female gender okay masculine and feminine which we call it as now look at this in the picture they have given all are sitting here uncle auntie aunt in english we call them as aunt and brother sister grandmother grandfather everyone this is about the picture now you have to read this it is just for reading purpose okay and uh, you see this as there are now you have to start writing from here you know me how I do the copy work. From here you will put as, I hope uh, it might be uh, this quite clear. So, okay, you have to put as Roman number 1 and you have to write there are. So, you have to make this small letter T into capital letter T. There are four types of gender. Okay, now yes students, there are four types of genders and what are they? Masculine, feminine, common and neuter gender. Correct. Now, putting this row number 2, Roman number 2, you have to add, you have to write this definition. What is masculine gender? A noun is said to be in the masculine gender if it refers to a male. That is uncle, father, grandfather and son. These types of nouns are called as masculine gender. Correct? So, Roman number 1 students, you will write this definition. Roman number 2, you will copy as it is. Next, come to page number 23. In page number 23, you can see where, it is, uh, where is Roman number 3? This is Roman number 3. A noun is said, now what do you mean by feminine gender? Feminine. A noun is said to be in feminine gender. Okay. When it refers to a female. Female example, it could be. Feminine gender, aunt, grandmother, daughter, sisters are feminine gender. Now come to Roman number 4. A noun is said to be, so when you are watching video students, please open your books and tally. So that I am explaining everything from the video from my own side only. Next come, the fourth degree is the common gender. Okay, what is this? Roman number 4, common gender. It refers to a male or female. It could be a male, a male or female. Like example, children and family are nouns of the common gender. Now come to fifth category. This is a neuter gender. A noun is said to be in the neuter gender when it refers to things. Just like we are talking about something. Suppose we are talking about furniture, we are talking about table, chairs, desk, books, etc. This comes under neuter gender. So till now I told you about four types of noun, my students. Masculine, feminine, common and neuter gender. Correct. Now come to this. Look at this. Now there are few ways by which we can indicate. This is a full dictionary they have given you. Wherein you have to learn. Make your books a best friend and please try to learn whatever is written in the book. In the book they provide the sufficient material. So please have the habit of reading the book. Now look at this. Masculine and feminine and what i have written here learn that means do do you need to write no only ma'am has told to learn only sirf yaad karna hai isko masculine this all and feminine this all i will send you the pictures also and because i have written some hard words like ram it is not ram it is ram male ship and uh, female ship eu boar male wild pig so female wild pig Stag male deer, female hint female deer. You have to learn this also. Just go through this and learn in my next class. I will ask you all. Okay. Okay students. Now look at this. This is your page number 24. Now here also they have given masculine, feminine. You, and what I have written here? Learn. You have to just go through it. Correct. Next one. This is a note part. I have just put your cross. That means no need to do this. Here also cross no need to do this. Just understand. For masculine we say Mr. Amit. For feminine we say Mrs. Anjana or it could be anything. 
your father and mother for father okay people might be referring before the name mr and for your mother before the name mrs correct and if anybody is um, if you have a sister and she is unmarried so before that we put miss what we put students miss okay miss spelling it could be m i s s dekhoge bahut jagah likha hota hai okay like that for unmarried girls miss and for unmarried boys of your age master master pratik master ashok master ram master ajay like that okay so this is the thing so master masculine miss feminine gender clear students this is a very small chapter and if you will learn thoroughly and understand my video you will understand in a better manner now come to page number 25 our exercise there are only two exercise in this book guys next what do you have to do in this rewrite each of the sentences in your notebook after changing the gender of the nouns make all the necessary changes now you have to change this correct now look at this now my aunt is a widow and her brother is a bachelor so how many uh, this you have to change it is not underlined here but i have underlined what all you have to change chap excess uh, question number 1 and 2 i'm i'm telling you as an example from 3 to 10 you have to do on your own look at this aunt so aunt is feminine or masculine it is feminine so feminine say we have to change into masculine so aunt will change into uncle good is a widow now widow is widow also we have to change widower and her brother her brother and we have to change one more thing that is we have to change your her kyunki we are changing the gender so aunt will change into uncle widow into widow her when i am saying uncle to uncle is a male so how can we put her here to so instead of her kya lagega his and brother will change into sister is a bachelor bachelor is a male word masculine the feminine of bachelor would be spinster i have written and i will send you the answers you copy down but first understand the female of bachelor would be spinster s p i s p i n s t e r okay let me write here s p i n s t e r spinster correct now look at the second one the duke duke is male we have to change duke while when you will write uh, this questions you can underline no problem you can underline so that i will understand what all you have changed duke will change into duchess called the young man the man will change into woman into his office so we will write his only no it will be into her office so though so the final answer would be the duchess called the young man sorry young woman into her office like this you have to change so as you can see many things i have changed in one sentence i have changed 1 2 3 4 5 in one sentence five words i have changed my neutrally and very uh, this uh, in a in a very uh, confident manner you have to solve this exercise correct now come to homework my dear students section number b complete this table i want you to do on your own correct we have to complete this table noun is given gender you have to write opposite gender you have to write example i am telling you i'll tell you only two rest you have to do for example bull so bull is which gender yahan pe likhna hai masculine gender and opposite of bull would be cow for this one you can search from dictionary and you have to search for this i want you to do on your own when you will do this exercise do it in with the pencil not with the pen brother father in law male will you write male or masculine yes you will write masculine okay masculine gender mas gender nahi likhna just likho masculine opposite of father in law mother in law 
Okay, like this you have to do and you have to show me. Correct? So students, my video is over. I hope you have liked my video and understood it as well. So we have done chapter number 6 for class 6 nouns gender wherein I talked about masculinity and femininity. I talked about neutral gender and common gender as well. Correct? Please like and subscribe my channel. Thank you.